Hello again, my crafty community. Today, through a slideshow and video, I'm going to be showing you how I created this beautiful fall card with my cling stamp, my embossing powder, and my Distress Oxide inks. Stay tuned. I embossed the matted piece with the Woodland Embossing Folder from Stampin' Up. Here I'm using my homemade stamp positioner, and this is the Copper Ranger Embossing Powder. And here's the finished result. I think it turned out really nice. I thought I'd go ahead and record this because it's so fun to watch the magic happen. I'm warming it up. For some reason, the copper just takes a hotter temperature to melt. Have any of you found that out? Okay, now I'm going to be doing Distress Oxide inking. I have one Distress ink and the rest are oxides. So let's get started. My first one will be the vintage photo. And I went ahead and Velcroed the sponge to this. And so I have my handy dandy tool. Light hand. And then we will do peeled paint. All the fall colors. Carved pumpkin or distress ink. Okay, and fired up brick red. Probably did a little more there than I wanted because I only have a little bit of space left for my yellow. Fossilized amber. Let's bring it up a little bit into here. And there we go. Emboss resist with distress oxide inks.